Hi. Today we're going to check out the differences between the Xpet Sinmat 7R and the Nemo Cosmo Insulated Integrated Pump 20R with Prima Loft. And they both have integrated pump. Mm. Yeah. The main difference is this, this one has the chambers on the long side, while this one has the chambers on the short. They both have this integrated pump on the expedits over here. And there's already been a review made with how long it takes to pump them. So I'm not going to bother you with that. Personally, I think it was easier to pump the expedit. Perhaps because my two hands are bigger than my one foot. Or, I don't know. The, um, I think it was easier and faster pumping the expedit. And this valve is a bit stronger, a bit bigger than the expedit. This one also has a little valve here to find adjust how hard you want it. And this is the deflation valve. The expert is slightly wider than the Nemo. And slightly thicker as well. The expat has big chambers here on the side while the Nemo it's like I, I tried it this night and it felt like I was rolling off it whereas on the expat I feel like I'm lying down here and some it's more concave the expat and that's actually the main reason why I decided to give this back to the shop, the Nemo. I've had Xpet for several years and I really like it. Yeah, and the matter of deflation time, well, I don't think it really matters. Because how I deflate my mat is just by lying on it and doing like this and then it deflates in a matter of seconds so it's not really an issue so all in all my recommendation is the expat Nemo's good I think it's even more expensive than Nemo but I'll go for expert anyway. And they have good warranty as well. There was one of the walls between the chambers that popped. And then I just went to the store and they gave me this one instead. So all in all, Xpet is cool. Nemo is cool too, but I just roll off it. That's all, folks.